How can swallows and sparrows know the thoughts of the great swan? It's origami time. With Mr. Mayberry. Time to flood. Today I'm going to show you how to make a swan. First we start with the kite base. Then turn it sideways like this. Fold this edge right here, not all the way to the center, but almost. Are we making a paper airplane? We're not making a paper airplane, but it does look kind of like that. Fold it, turn it around, and do the same thing to the other half. Okay, fold the bottom all the way to the top. This point should fit up in, right inside the top. Press good on your folds. Fold this top point down to where these two points can are. Pretend there's a line that goes across there, and that's how far you fold it over. So the top edge is even with that. Just like that. You take the whole thing and fold it in half to look like this. Then you take this part and you pull it, pull that up. There's the neck. And we pull this up and this is the bird beak, the swan beak. And this is our project for today. A swan. Brighten someone's day. Give your origami away. Origami for your mommy.